everybody, this is Patricia and welcome back to my channel. Today, instead of my normal chatty get ready with me, I need some help. Today, I'm going to work on uh, my makeup look for my Halloween costume for Mickey's Not So Scary Halloween Party. There's my costume. Here's my ears. I'm going as like a Mad Hatter. So that's the costume. It's green on top. And then the overskirt is white with a yellow ruffle and a bright purple ribbon. And the underskirt is black with teacups and teapots all over it in various shades of pink, brights, uh, brights and pastels. There's pinks, blues, greens, teals, just all different colors. And so, and then there's a yellow bow that matches that ribbon. The yellow bow will fit around my neck. And then this is my ears. And I purchased my ears from an Etsy shop, and I can't remember the name of it right now, but I'll link it down below. So, and I got my hair in two ponytails. There we go. So, this is the look I'm going for for my Mickey's Not So Scary Halloween Party costume. Now, I just need to figure out my eyeshadows. Um, I have foundation, I have blush, I have bronzer. I have all that on. Got my brows done. All I need to do is the eyeshadow, and uh, I didn't put any highlighter on yet, and this lighting is so horrible, and I am so sorry. That company still does not have the replacement bulbs in stock so i'll have to figure something out when i get back from vacation but um because i just can't keep going like this uh today is a gloomy nasty rainy day and you can't even see out that window uh gloomy nasty rainy yucky um and no natural light coming in so i'm going to try to get a little closer and hopefully we get this get this eyeshadow figured out. So let's get started. I chose my palettes I'm taking. I'm taking my Tartlet in Bloom, and this is mainly for my everyday look, but we can uh, pull from this. I'm gonna open it, set it right there. I'm gonna take my uh, Too Faced Nikki Tutorials. Again, mainly, I need to put that plastic. Mainly for my everyday looks, but definitely, I see potential right in here. And then this ColourPop palette that I made that has, um, colors are horrible. You can't really see. This is an orange, and it looks, here, can, there we go. It's an orange and then more of a red. And um, this is a true fuchsia pink or hot pink and this one is got some more purple in it or maybe this is more like real hot pink and no fuchsia hello you want to see it fuchsia pink and um fuchsia with more of a purple in it and i have no clue i haven't even thought what i'm going to do i just picked colors so I'm going to start off both eyes the same by setting the whole entire eye area with a shadow. And it looks like Charmer and Ivy, Charmer in this one, Ivy in this one look so much alike. Do I want to do that or do I want to do something different? Let's just set everything in Ivy. Ivy. And then um, it's more of a, just a, a light cream color. It's a matte. I'm going to take this big fluffy crease brush or a uh, blender brush from BH Cosmetics. I'm just going to use it because it really covers an entire area quickly. So there we go. So it's great for just putting your base. Well, I call my base shade down. There we go. Now, what am I going to do? What am I going to do? I, I need a nice crease shade that um, 
is a mat. Let's do this first off first. I am going to go in with, I'm going in with painkiller. I think by putting a shadow over that, you can see more of the, that's the real color. I am going to take a brush. I'm going to take this Elizabeth Mott blending brush. Oh, I thought it had stopped there for a minute. I'm going into painkiller and I'm just going to do this eye. Let's see if I can remember just to stop at one eye. And I'm going to put this down in my crease. Oh, it's a good thing I'm filming this because I probably won't remember what I'm doing. My memory has gotten so horrible. This lighting, I am sorry. I will take a photo and it will be my thumbnail when I get done. And maybe that can help us look and see what these are going to look like. I feel like I'm real bright, but I need that light. Is that? I, I don't. <sighs> I gotta figure something out. Okay. We'll we'll just do this from time to time. All right. Now, what do I want on my eye? I think I'm not going to use the tartlet and bloom on this one. <clears throat> and excuse me, I'm coughing. Got my water. Mmm, do I want to go? We're going to play. This is all for experiment. This is irresistible. That is that gold. That is cool. But I think I'm going to put other colors down before I, I mess with that. Let's play. Oh, I got an idea. Where's my. I'm going to take my. This is my Royal Langnickel uh, detail brush. This small one. See all my forehead there. I'm going to go into Mystic Hour and into this. Wham bam. So, oh, by the way, I've got my uh, Mickey, uh, not, excuse me, my Nightmare Before Christmas t shirt on just to put me in the mood. Just a little something. I think I'm going to go, I think I'm going to go Mystic Hour. Hello, cutie. Oh, I need to get closer. And nothing I have here has a mirror. Mystic Hour in this inner corner, like this. I have a... Sorry, shake y'all around. The lighting in here is just horrible anyway. With the weather like it is. Okay, I... Uh, can you see me? Yeah. All right, that's Mystic Hour. Clean this brush out. And I'm going into Wham Bam, which is purple. And it is the same color as the ribbon on my costume, that purple. That's the color of the ribbon on my costume. I'm going to do the outer V. Whoops. Don't want to block you. Hmm. This is not as pigmented. I need 
some real setting spray. I'm going to spray my brush. Actually, I'm going to put some color on. Spray my brush. Can you see? And see if this will pack it on a little darker. Yeah, there we go. There we go. That gives me the purple I want. There we go. Alrighty. And I'm probably going to need it for the gold. Because next I'm going to take the gold. Try this irresistible without the spray. Spray my brush. Ooh. There we go. There's the payoff. My oh my. Mm -hmm. Wow. Some Mardi Gras. That's Mardi Gras colors. Now, that's not enough for me. So I'm going to take Hungry. I am. I have a million brushes. Why do I keep pulling from the same ones? Is that too big? That's too big. Okay, I'm going to take this e.l.f. crease brush. And I'm going to go in with, I think this is O Ship. Yep. That one, O Ship. And I'm going to try to be careful with these. Look how pigmented that is. This is a very clean brush. Never been used. I'm trying to knock some of that pigment off. I might be ruining this look right now. grab this blender. I'm going to go back into this. I think I'm going back into Wham Bam. I want a different brush than this. I think I do. I'm going with this brush. Oh, can you see the? There you go. The pointy tip brush. Going back into Wham Bam, which is the purple, and putting it here on the this area of my eye right here. Hmm. Hope you guys are finding this fun. I kind of am. I am going to have to take a photograph so you can really see what I'm doing here. I like that. 
Kind of, sort of, yeah. All right, I'm gonna take the same brush, go in the wham bam, and go under my eye with it. And I think I'm gonna let it be a little messy and not so perfect, so it's smudged out under my eye. Yeah. Wow. I'm actually liking this a lot. Yep. I like this a lot. Now, do I want eyeliner or no? I'm going to get that gold in here. Let me clean out this brush. The little detail brush. I don't want to do anything too complicated um, because I do, I am going to be just writing, um, you know, rods and I just want to have fun. Pretty cool. do that. I think I could have done without that. Keep it down. Put some mascara on with this and see. can't wear my false eyelashes because I will be wearing my glasses. I have yet to find any contacts I can wear. I used to can wear contacts all, and I wore them all the time. And then as my eyes got worse, um, I'm now, they don't call them bifocals. So I forgot what it's called. But um, progressive. I have progressive lenses. Um, we've tried different ways of contacts and they just give me migraines just gives me migraines so and this mascara is flaking underneath my nose is just i'm gonna take this same brush Let's see if i can get these flakes out there we go. There's one eye. Okay. Let's do another eye. What are we going to do on the other side? As my nose itches. Ah, uh, allergies. And my stomach growls. It's hungry. Um... I think I'm going to do a deeper eye, deeper, darker, deeper, darker eye. Let's try that. So this one's like a lighted, lighter, kind of, let's go a little deeper, darker. I'm going to go back into this mop with this Elizabeth Mott blending brush. Switch colors. I'm still in the Too Faced Nikki tutorial palette. I'm going to go in Makeup and Chill, which 
it looks a different color there that's it's more of a dark brown I have a daylight bulb in the lamp right here I wonder if darker crease will make the eye, the lid, pop out more. I'm going to grab, wipe it out a little bit. Beach Cosmetics Blender. This is a great brush. It's the number 12. Um, and it's called a blender brush. I don't remember which collection it was in, but it's solid black. It's a good brush. Okay. Now. Itchy nose. I'm going to take another brush. I'm going to take this brush. This is, um, it's a Royal Lang Nickel. It's a crease brush, Moda Pro. Okay, I'm going to go in sugar coated. Make sure I have a clean finger here. Let me see sugar coated. It's a pink shimmer. There we go. It's a pink shimmer. And I'm going to put that. It's just brushed. I'm going to go with it anyway. I'm going to put that on my lid. this crease brush and I am going to go into my color pop and I'm what color is this I'm going into seize the day which is the one that has a little more purple in it seize the day and that is going on the outer Very outer corner here of my eyelid. You can see, yeah. I'm going to wipe that out. Then I'm going into the color right next to it, which is For Sure. For Sure. Grab that on my brush. And then I'm going right next to that one. There we go. Looks good. Then I'm going to go back into the sugar coated. Make sure that colors out with my setting spray and pack that on the inner corner. So I have a very pink eye.
that's cute. Now I am going to boo, boo, boo. I'm gonna grab another brush. This is I think this is a yeah, Coastal Sense brush brush and I am going into um, the purple wham bam and I am going to work it into this crease up here blender brush blend then I am going to clean out this pointy, pointy brush I have. And I'm going into Mystic Hour back in the Nikki Tutorials. Going into Mystic Hour. I'm going under with Mystic Hour. Again, I want it to be smudged. Take that up, I think, and blend it right in here. Get the blender brush. Let me see if I can kind of blend that together. Blend it out and up a little. Okay. They're very different, aren't they? Put mascara on. Now, I didn't put any liner on for either of these looks. So, what do you think? Liner, no liner? Um, should I do attempt wing? Wing liner? Do I do? Why aren't you answering me? Why aren't you right here? I need you right here. Oh, gracious. Wow. There we go. Let me grab, I'm going to grab my uh, highlight. I don't see my highlight regular brush. I'll just grab this brush. It's clean. It's a clean, it's a clean brush. And let's see, where is my little detail brush? I should get myself another one of these or several. I love this brush. I'm going into my highlighter. Now I put gold from the other from the palette on one eye. We'll see how the highlighter does compared to the gold. 
They're very, it's practically the same. It's the same. It is the same. Hmm. So, what do we think? This one has purple underneath. I feel like I'm at the eye doctor. And then a little touch of the teal, you know, well, you saw, you, you were watching me. You know what I did. And then this one has the teal underneath. So that's what I'll call it. Purple eye, teal eye. What do you think? What, what do you think? This one, I put red in the, um, crease. This one, I put the purple in the crease. Or do I go one eye one way and one eye the other and just go with them like this where each eye is different? It's Halloween. Do whatever I want. Where's mine? I haven't even picked a lipstick. Haven't even picked a lipstick. I am going to do something. This is just my natural lip color. So... Let's, I want to look at something real quick. That's Smashbox. I don't want to look at that one. Here we are. I have my Wonder Metals, AOA Studio Wonder Metals, and yes. And then I have my Urban Decay Special Effects in Fever. So let's do half my mouth with yes and the other half with Fever. If we can tell by this. It's very different. Yeah, you can't tell. You can't. I can. Um... This side is just pure metallic, and this side is just iridescent uh, holographic glitters. All right, there we go. I'm going to wear the metallic lip with the glitter on top. It's right here. I wish you could just really see. The lighting is just sucky, sucky lighting. I don't forget it when I pack. Oh, yes. Disco metallic lips for Halloween. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I'm sitting back here. Can you see? Is it any better? Is the lighting not as sucky? I will take a photo of all of this and post it as my my thumbnail. So tell me, purple, teal, both. Mm. 
What do you think? Kind of like the lips. I like the metallic lips. Oh, we have something else to figure out. I totally forgot. Glasses. I have to wear my glasses. I can't see without them. Now, this is, these are the glasses. Oh God, they're so dirty. These are the glasses that I'm currently wearing all the time. So, we'll call these, uh, let's just number one, two, three, four to make it easier. This is one. That's what I'm wearing all the time. These are also Chanel glasses. I don't wear these as much as I used to. I really just need to pull them out and wear them. This is two. These have rhinestones, the shiny, I guess you could see it. The rhinestones on the side. So this is look number two. Now these are LaFont glasses. And these are also cat eyes. These are number three. That's pretty cool. And did I, I didn't grab a pair. Hang on one second. Okay, I'm back. And then this is also LaFont. These will be number four. So, this is four, three, kind of cute, huh? Two, and one. I don't know. I love them all. These have the bling. Blingy blingy. Um, this will be at night, so um, the two Chanel pair transition. The other two pair do not. The LaFont do not have transition lenses. So, um, we will be there from four to whenever the sun goes down. Um, but I will have my sunglasses with me so I can pop those on. Um, but so, yeah, so this is two. These are three. Oh, two, three. It's like the doctor's office. Which one looks better? Number two or number three? Two. Three. This is four. These are, yeah, these are four. With the white on the top. I don't know. I like them all. I'm going to let you guys decide what glasses I'm going to wear for uh, the party. So you got it? The ones I'm wearing now every day, these are Chanel's. Um, this is one. These are Chanel's with the, the diamonds on the side. So that's number two. This is LaFont cat eyes. And these are like a purple color. That's number three. And these are LaFont with the, that's black and white. So that's number four. You choose my glasses and you choose my eyes. And I'm going to go with with what you choose. So in the comment down below, say um, you want um, a purple eye and number three glasses or teal eye and number two glasses or whichever, or both, both and which pair of glasses, both and Number four glasses. Yeah. 
pick. Pick. I, I would have really need. I need. I need some help. So please pick. Also, if you want a postcard from Disney or Universal, comment down below. Or better yet, if you want a postcard from Disney or Universal, my email address is down below. Send me your address. Send me your name and address. Tell me, do you want a Disney postcard or do you want a Universal postcard? And I will send you postcards while I am on vacation. Because I do think about you when I go out. Uh, I've made lots of friends on this channel and uh, I don't post it all the time, but some of you get postcards from me when I'm out and about. And so if I have your address and I'm thinking about you, I'll send you a postcard. So if you definitely want a postcard from Disney, I already know, I know what Station wants. So everybody else, if you want a postcard from Disney or Universal, shoot me an email and give me your name and address. Tell me where you want a postcard from. And I will send you one. So thank you all so much for your help. Purple eye, teal eye. One, two, three, four. Okay, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time.